Hey guys, um, I'm doing another test on the mica powder and um, I'm convinced I don't need a cell activator, Poly Win Max, Australian Floetrol, a special base, all these things. I, I just, I'm going to find a way. I am gonna find a way. Um, I have two new mica powders that I got today, this like turquoise and then this gold, both made by that same company that uh, makes the crushed crystal magical mica. Um, I like their products, so I ordered more different colors just to see if it was as amazing. So, we're gonna find out. Ooh, it's a little happy face. I really like this color, so I'm putting extra on. And then I just have like a normal light blue that's just mixed two parts Floetrol, one part water, one part paint. Hey guys, here's this one wet. That's kind of cool, all those. So it's going on in there. But that's cool. And then I like how this all turned out. This gold, um, when I tipped it on its side, is so freaking amazing. I cannot wait for this to dry. It just looks so shimmery. Um, I'll put a link in the description to these micas. Hey guys, this one turned out actually really cool. Um, for just two micas and one color. I like everything that's happening in there. Um, but then it was all lost down at the bottom. So this gold though is like... Um, it's crazy. It didn't really produce the cells that the other micas did, but it's like, when they say 24 karat gold, it is, it is shimmery. Um, so yeah, there's that one I'm going to, Keep trying.